I make nail polish for boys. Nail polish, it's not very accepting for guys. Some people get bullied, will get targeted. My brand is called Glossy Boys. It's this gel nail polish brand made for guys just to have fun painting their nails. I saw my sister and my mum wearing nail polish and I was like, I want to do that. So I asked my mum if we can go down to the pharmacy to go buy some nail polish. I was 12. We went down to the store and I just felt super duper awkward and uncomfortable. It's a big pink pharmacy and it's not very welcome and inclusive. We went up to the counter, my palms were sweaty and my, my heart was racing. I wanted to go in there, find a bottle of nail polish and feel accepted. I created Glossy Boys so guys didn't have to go through that. It's just this gel nail polish that you can paint straight on. It's unique because it's not in a bottle and it's in a pen. Normal nail polish, it's just a very, very long process. It takes a whole bunch of like base coat, top coat, middle. This is three in one, you paint straight on. We have the everything kit. This is everything to paint your nails and take it off. So you'll get your pen and then you just get straight to painting. Because it's gel, you have to have a UV light to dry it really quickly. You get the light and you just plug it into the wall. You put them in there and it dries and that's all done. For the everything kit, you can order individual pens. These are $12.95. Glossy Boys have been in the works for about a year, just opened a couple months ago. So we started trying to create the look of the branding. When we were in that early stages of making the brand, we had to have like a target audience. My market's 12 to 24, young males. We've saved up a lot of money. So we've gotten a manufacturer that makes all this stuff. Mainly my mum has done extensive research. When we first started, we've gotten a couple orders, but now it's just been increasing. This Australian LGBT, QIA plus really popular comedian. He ordered our product, he did a video about us, and that night we grew thousands of followers. It's been pretty crazy and it's just been kind of stressful. Having to balance school life and work life. I get to school and then get home, do my homework, and just do a whole bunch of stuff for Instagram and TikTok, like filming and skating and a lot of packing orders. I get my family to help with getting stock and packing orders. We have gotten so much good feedback. Some people at school would say, isn't that for girls? We try and like, like push that away. Glossy boys are supposed to be positive and just for everyone. It doesn't have to be just male identifying people. If you're an entrepreneur, be confident. And if you get criticism, don't let that push you back. Let that push you forward. Another tip is just have fun. Just be comfortable who you are. I am seen. Are you? One, two, one, two. So Kristen Hull, this really good comedi com Australian comedian, um, he ordered our nail polish just out of the blue, uh, found us on Instagram, and he's just got it, and I hope that he really, really enjoys it. And I think he does. This is crazy, by the way. We've got a total of 546 uh, total sessions today. So that's a lot. Thank you so much, Christian Hull. If you don't know... A Perth youngster has found overnight success by creating nail polish just for boys. A 12-year-old Perth boy is shaking up traditional beauty expectations by creating a nail polish line for lads. Lucas Lane calls the varnish male polish and it's gone viral. I've always been curious to paint my nails and I've never done it before and I stumbled across... Wait, what? I couldn't be here. Like, I couldn't be here without you, like... On the radio. Say hi, Christine. Entrepreneur hopes it could be the start of a lifelong career. Honestly, super excited about it. It's just so little, he's so little, he's so young, but doing such a beautiful job. It is really quite, it makes us so proud. One, two, one, two, three, let's go! this the other day knowing that it would upset a few people but what I didn't anticipate was upsetting people about my toenails so I thought I better make that right I made a new little purchase so there's this cool ass little kid over in Western Australia who got shamed for trying to buy nail polish one day and he thought that's not cool I'm gonna start my own company 
and he did. It's called Glossy Boys. I'm gonna tag it in this video, so make sure you go and check his page out. Basically, he makes these cool little kits with these nail polish pens in them. How cool is that? These pens are so easy to use, you can even do your nails while you're tracking across site. And the UV curing light's portable, so like while you're waiting for trucks, perfect time. I'm not gonna lie, I am, I'm impressed. I saw this product and I brought it just because I thought it was a cool idea and just wanted to support out a kid who was trying to do something cool with his life. Um, now I've got it, I'm definitely going to be a repeat customer. My daughter is going to lose it when she sees these. So yeah, make sure you head along, check out Glossy Boys and if you want to buy a present for someone, an awesome present that they probably haven't seen before, I highly recommend. Great job Lucas, thanks man. Okay, Absolutely crazy, I couldn't have done the... I couldn't have done this without you, like, another big thank you, like, is absolutely crazy. I've always been curious to paint my nails, and I've never done it before, and I stumbled across... Wait... What? Hi, I'm Lucas, and I'm 12 years old, and I'm an entrepreneur. He's only just hit high school, but Lucas Lane can already add successful business owner to his resume. <laughs> the Year 8 student created Glossy Boys, an all-inclusive nail polish company founded after an awkward interaction in a pharmacy. Well, I always saw my sister and my mother wearing nail polish, and I thought that was pretty cool and I would like to get some because I didn't know what to think, what to say and like what I was going to get because there's no real products made for me or other male identifying people. Since launching at the end of June, the company's taken off, skyrocketing last night after well-known Aussie comedian Christian Hull posted this video to his 1.6 million TikTok followers. This is amazing. This is so... Lucas, well bloody done. Since then, online searches have gone through the roof. Glossy Boys had 81 orders overnight, compared to just 14 total last month. They're now sold out. Whenever I just look down at it, it just makes me feel happy. Shattering assumptions, one glossy nail at a time. Cassidy Moscone, 7 News. color that I want to show you to you guys. It's called Purple Haze. It's just super duper cool purple. You guys have been asking for a purple, so we delivered, and this is Purple Haze. And there we go. Click the link. And there we go. That's our store. Go check it out. Link in the description. Have fun.
about to destroy my all right about to destroy my beautiful nail polish got some new colors here they are and we're just um photographing them in the light box so stuff like this and this and um photos with a pen because when you go onto the website you when you click in your colors you can actually see the pet um the hands with the pens and this is how we do it so we just got dad here um photographing while i stick my hand in there see it all nice and we have a whole bunch of props and stuff like that and we use a pen so this is how we get professional looking um photos done for glossy boys right at home so these are our two new colors this is an orange high viz it's a pretty cool color i really like it with purple yep deep purple it's a pretty rad color and i really like it and i hope you do as well <laughs> and then dry it you can have four fingers there and one light on your thumb five minutes three to five minutes and then do another coat and then repeat the process so this is a super rad board um fit with some super rad nails all matching which is pretty nice so this is um a power Peralta. so a power Peralta old school skateboard from the eight. and it's a limited edition it's the series 12 so power Peralta does these series with the famous six bones brigade members so we've got tony hawk which you might know steve capillaro mike mcgill Rob, rodney mullen which you might know and lance mountain and this is tommy guerrero's pro model and it's just a sick deck um with these sick nails and even the nail stickers like the fire nail stickers match with, matches with this board such a rad board that's the top graphic there and i'm so happy to have this hanging on my wall probably one of the raddest decks that i have Hanging up here. Yeah, pretty rad. So hey everyone, um, I'm just painting my nails now and I'm just gonna give a couple tips about painting your nails and the color that I'm gonna be using is black and purple haze. And you can find like these clipper things. Um, here. They're really useful, um, and it's good for like when you paint it, when you paint your nails and you dry them, because you can get some bits here, like there's a bit here, that's, yeah, that's dry. So you can just sort of grab that and clip it off. It's super easy, and it doesn't take your skin off, which is kind of nice, not having your skin being peeled off. So that's why these are really good. Plus, if you um. Even when non-painting, you know how you get those like little like skin tags on your like your thumb? You can just like take that off. Cause and plus it just makes your nail just look much nicer. There we go. Let's get back to painting. <laughs> 